Hello and welcome back to Persona 3 Reload. Last time we got a ton of new activities that we can do in the evening, but we are not in the evening. As you can see from the sky, we are in fact during the day, which means that we need to go into the correct menu and figure out just what to do. Now, we got Bunkichi, we got the Gourmet King, we've got Chihiro, but we've also got Kisuke Hiraga, who is, of course, the art club. So, we should probably do the art club. Um, what is the art club's thing? It's fortune, right? Do we have a fortune persona? We do not. Okay, step one, get a fortune persona. We can do that. Why are we doing this one over... Also, I Good just want to double check something here. Are you accepting a request? That's fine. Why are we doing this one over doing well. Chihiro? The reason we're doing this one over Chihiro is because this is a social link that we want to do and we have an advancement on this day. Therefore, it's highest priority on the list. If it was against Welcome a social link the that we room. weren't that interested in completing, then it would, um, then we would go and do Chihiro. But because we actively want to do this one, because I didn't do it in FES, I think it makes sense to um, this is go your and so do far. it now. So looking for fortune. Do we have a fortune persona? Uh, no. <laughs> Is that really the lowest um, fortune persona? Does 20? That persona catch your eye? Let me, sorry, let me find it here. Yeah, this, this level 20 one really is the lowest. Okay, what can we fuse to no. make that then? Well then. Uh, Shall we take 20. A look? Nothing. <laughs> we can fuse nothing to make it. We saw it once. Uh, oh, we can make a Kushi Mitama, but we can only make that. Ah. Now this puts a little bit of a twist See, in it. We can only make that for level 28. Is a great that is a problem. The reason why this is a problem is because that changes our um, that we changes our balance slightly in terms of what we do. Because now it's an option of doing Chihiro or doing a social link that we will not get maximum points out of. Now, getting maximum points is really, really important, because otherwise you end up in situations like we have ended up with our current ones. Like Bunkichi, we did without having the persona. Therefore, the social link has petered out. Same with Gourmet King, same with Chihiro. So, and same with Kenji for that matter. So, if we want to do as many social links uh, activities without um, having to do like one of these interim activities that we're doing with Chihiro and the Gourmet King, then what we should do is we should wait until we have the Persona. The thing is, to wait until we have the Persona means we have to wait until we go back into Tartarus, which means, yeah, we're going to have to wait a little bit. We have plenty of time though, because they meet uh, three days a week, right? So, in theory, we it's uh, I think it's Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. In theory, we should be able to meet with them like... Um, like every single day for all of these weeks and then we'll have it done by like the end of July or August actually yeah so we should be fine um let's go do Chihiro then yeah let's go do her social link that I think makes the most sense to me this isn't where I thought we were going there we go oh hello my friend said that this guy disappeared from the town nearby. He might be a victim of that revenge website. Oh, a revenge website, huh? Wait, what's that? That sounds super bad. Hmm. Hello. Yes, we are going to hang out. Let's do that. Yeah, and we can go to the library first, that's fine. Same thing as last time. I feel like uh, my bond with Chihiro uh, or I feel it grows stronger as we spend time together. And then our relationship will grow stronger soon. Okay, so we can get an advancement on the next one. Cool. It's about time to leave school. Well, let's do that then. It's now the evening. Our, bid er, our busiest time. I see you're back. Okay. Uh, nobody has anything for us to do. However, we are missing Fuka, so she might have something. Let's see. While we can't slack on our exploration of Tartarus if we want to solve its mysteries, it's important to rest and take time for yourself as well. You're free to go out or spend time with the others in the dorm, just don't stay up too late. Yo. No matter the battle, a proper balance is key to winning. Not just power, mental strength, agility and some luck too. 
It's not easy to train up each aspect, but if you keep exper experiencing what life has to offer, you'll get the training along the way. Hello. Hey, um... I keep thinking about how Kirijo-senpai dragged Fuka into this, but Fuka really seems determined to do her best, so I guess there's no point in dwelling on it. Instead, I'll just focus on doing my best, too. Okay. Where is Fuka? You want to read some books? Okay, we can read books, that's fine. Let's do a little sa uh, save in a new slot as well here. Hello. Um, um, what are you doing? Hi. Um, do you like to read books, Applicoon? You see, there's this near future sci-fi series that was popular a while back. I found it at a used bookstore and bought the whole series, but it's been sitting on my shelf for a long time. <laughs> I only started reading it after moving into the dorm and it's really interesting. Could help with my academics. Okay. If you're interested, would you like to read the first book? Let's read together. All right. Glad to hear it. Okay, I'll go get them from my room. Do you read a lot of science fiction novels like this? Um, I enjoy one here or there. I wonder what that exactly means. The core fan base for the sci-fi genre can get pretty picky. Uh-huh. It's the ones who answer like you that turn out to be the hardcore fans. Don't call me out like that. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt while you were reading. If you don't mind, can you let me know your thoughts once you finish it? Oh, I didn't notice the time. How far did you get? Wow, you've read that much already? We, we're just good at everything. We're good at our job. We're good at fighting uh, persona or fighting demons with our personas. We're good at reading. We are the expert at everything. Huh? I made a lot of progress too. Was I more focused than usual or? I feel like my academics have improved thanks to the skillful expression in the writing. All right, how many do we get? We got one. Okay. So not as good as going to the arcade. Interesting. <sighs> um, if you don't mind, do you think we could read here again sometime? Although, it is more interesting than going to the arcade, and it looks like these are potentially advancing storylines. Like, if you hang out with them the first time, she'll say, hey, do you want to read the first book? The second time, she might be like, hey, you finished the book? Oh, wow, let's chat about it. And then that might advance that story, which might then get you some extra points. So, yeah, um, the first one doesn't get you as much, but... Maybe the second one will. Say it's similar with how Akihiko was kind of hinting that his second cooking might be more involved, right? It could be more. Of course, I have no idea because I haven't done this, but that's the way I'm reading into it. I used to think reading was only a solo activity, but now I think reading with someone helps me immerse myself deeper into the fictional world. I'm here whenever I can spare the time, so come by if you can. I'd be happy to have you. All right, that's enough for today. Good night. Good night. Okay, and now we have Friday. Oh, hello. Good morning, Zaplacoon. Um, it's a beautiful day, is it not? How are you faring today? Uh, not bad. Uh, that is wonderful news. Sorry for being so awkward. I've never had a chance to chat with someone on the way to school, so I get nervous. I think I'm getting used to life in the dorm. Plus, I'm pretty excited about everything we can do there. I'd love to try caring for the plants up on the roof. No, no, the, the plants are mine. Anything, really, when we have the time. She's going to keep asking me about the plants, isn't she? She's not going to let it go. Okay, class has ended for today. Uh, Work-related, sewing machine, Kenji, that's fine, right. Oh, hello. I saw this girl in a gothic Lolita get up in front of the station. Man, she was so cute, I had to go up and ask her out. I said, hey, want to catch a movie or something? But she didn't even move except for breathing. She didn't, didn't even bother looking my way. My ego still isn't recovered. Ooh, that reminds me. Not of going and seeing this person, but instead... Oh, her social link can start? Interesting. Um, I wonder if anyone did it. 
No. Interesting. Um, I got completely distracted. Yeah, but we didn't go to Rafflesia when they said they had new stuff. Oh, hello. Oh. Hello there, Zaplacoon. We don't have any club activities today, so what brings you here? Whenever I look around the school, I always see a few students who look unwell. Hopefully they're just lacking sleep, but there's a chance they could actually be sick too. Uh. <laughs> Oops, sorry, didn't mean to get carried away. Just keep an eye out on your health as well, okay? Okay. Kind of weird vibes coming from you there. Um, I just had a sudden realization. You know how the nurse gives you courage every time you go to Tartarus? I just realized, I think that's to encourage you to go there so you don't lose, uh, but like not get you to worry about your social stats. Because I was just thinking, wait a second, if we go to Tartarus and then the next day we get a courage stat, that's almost like just doing one of the single courage activities. Huh. Just realizing the uh, subtle gameplay uh, hint they put in there for you, like, don't worry about it, it you can still raise a stat while doing that. Obviously, it's not as efficient, but still, it's interesting. I'm waiting for my boyfriend. I heard from my friend that there's this freaky website that's really taking off. I'm going to ask my boyfriend about it, because he's good with computers. And as you know, everybody who's good with computers knows everything on the internet. It's just the way of things. Right. Oh! We appeared at this site? Okay. He's really overthinking this. He looks suave, but he's worried. But he worries what other people think too much. I mean, I love that he cares about my opinion, but I think I'd prefer it if he didn't feel so nervous with me. Got to find someone to talk about. But what? Hello. I heard about the disaster from someone I know who works at Gekukan High. What disaster? Wow, I admire your apathy. That's the spirit. Whatever happens around you, just don't give a damn about it. An attitude like that will come in handy once you enter the workforce. Okay, no, but like, oh yeah? I think that's awful way those students are falling victim to apathy syndrome. Probably because of all the excess studying. Why would they study so hard? I hope they don't have delusions of going to a famous university and getting a high paying job. Honestly, you're depressing. I'm gonna leave. Hello. You know how in movies you see bodyguards with tattoos on their arms and you know they're badass? Well, I saw a guy like that in town. His arm was just completely covered in tattoos. But he wasn't built like a bodyguard, though. He was real thin. Plus, he wasn't wearing a shirt. It really stuck out from the crowd. Oh, God. Okay. Hello. If you go down the side street, you'll come to a spot where gangs gather. They always leave garbage behind and spray graffiti all over the walls. And every time, I'm the one who has to clean it up. I'm going to catch these gangs someday and make them clean it up themselves. Okay. Hello. Welcome. Take your time looking around. Uh, I would like whatever you got this new. Oh, an onion. Okay. Sure. I'll buy a couple of those. I'll also buy a couple of buff po uh, potato sprouts. Okay. Um. We'll also buy your. Oh wait, did I buy one of everything already? Wow. Please come. I. Oh, I didn't buy the rose. Okay. That's fine. I must have used it already. Head this way. Hello. My buddy says that these three weirdos come here a lot, but I haven't seen them yet. I couldn't give a crap about them. As long as they don't start any shit, they're cool with me. Alright. Well, now we've done that, um, I want to do this. So, baby... Oh, Fuka, you see, it's right there. Um, baby Odagiri Miyamoto. Hmm. Well, I mean, we might as well hang out with Fuka while she's here. There's no reason not to get the social link, right? I seem to remember there being some requirement, some restriction, but we'll see. Oh, oh Zaplacoon, are you on your way home? Let's walk home together. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry, I was about to do some research. I'm actually learning how to cook, but I'm still just experimenting. I don't think I can make anything edible at this point. I don't want to waste your time. If I volunteer to help her, I might regret it. I don't have the courage to risk it. I would have to be badass. Oh, that was the restriction. We had to get badass. Okay, interesting. So, Fuka, oh, 
that is a really cool UI element there. It grays it out if you've checked and you don't have the um, stats. Okay, so that's why nobody did it today, because nobody had badass courage, because nobody grinds courage out in the early game so that you can hang out with Fuka as early as possible. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Um, so, Bebe is one that we have the persona for. We haven't done the gourmet... Ah, I guess we should hang out with the gourmet king. Yeah, I guess we should. Because if we want to get his done, we need to actually hang out with him. So let's do that. Listen. Right. Let's go. Yes. Yes. Okay. All of this, I think, is stuff we've had before. Same place, same stuff. That's fine. He didn't say we'll grow stronger soon. Okay, so we need to spend at least one more day with him. Okay. That's cool. Welcome back. What's up, dude? Sorry, dude. I'm running to the store real quick. That means he's unavailable, I'm guessing. Games! Rain festivals long go. Especially this year, when forecasters are expecting little rain, the festival is called for. Okay, I want to head out here just temporarily. I do want to come back, but I want to just do a quick run around the mall. Just to check if there's any new voice line. Oh, not voice lines, but dialogue lines. That's the word I was looking for. Oh, hello. I hear there's a growing movement on the internet these days. I don't know what it's called, but this one guy is gathering a lot of users or lots of users around him. I'm not sure what he's up to or why, but he's not just being overhyped. This guy definitely knows what he's doing. Maybe I should check him out sometime. I feel it's worth doing this area specifically because. This is an area that was not available in FES, so this dialogue is all new. You know anything else that's uh, new in here, by the way? Come on. Uh, no. Okay. That's fine. We're just checking it out anyway. Okay, and then we want to check out the other area which is available. It's actually weird that this area is also available. There must be something else that happens here. Usually, cabbies work night shifts. If I don't sleep during the day, when am I supposed to sleep? My wife gets steamed, saying we never talk anymore. She's no idea what I'm going through. Hmm. That's a tough one. That is a tough one. Well, we'll leave you be. Uh, we've been to Polonia, so let's go back to the dorm. And we're going to hang out with Yukari. I think. Well, actually, let's just check upstairs. Yeah. Okay. Um... Wonder if this has anything new on it now. Oh, this just says go to Tartarus. Look at the bulletin board. No. Okay. Um. Hello. Hmm. I got enthusiastic about cooking for myself once, but I bought way too many ingredients. I'm gonna have a lot of leftovers on my hands. Uh, sure. Thanks. Awesome. Let's go make something tasty. I picked up the ingredients to make chicken saute today, but. I might have bought too much. I think my eyes are bigger than my stomach. I always end up having leftovers. What about you? Would you say you're a big eater? Um, I eat like a bird, I eat like a pig, depends on the taste. Uh, I'm gonna say I eat like a pig and see what she says to that. Oh, sounds like a healthy appetite. You're in luck because we've got plenty. I hope it tastes all right, but... Don't get your hopes too high, okay? I haven't been cooking much lately. Well, either way, it'll be packed full of nutrients, so don't worry about that. They say your health is your most valuable asset, you know? I figured we should think about what we're putting into our bodies. And if I could lose some weight while we're at it, I'd kill two birds with one stone. But let's put that aside for now. Anyway, why don't we start with veggies? Can you cut the tomatoes for me? Okay. I made chicken saute with yukari. Uh... I mean, it looks... fine? Yeah? I chose breast meat because it was cheap and I heard it's good for a diet, but it's kind of dry. Okay, very dry. I can barely chew through it. And that was unexpected. I don't usually mess up this kind of thing. Hey, you're doubting me, aren't you? I'm serious. One 
dry chicken saute. I'll make up for it next time. So let's cook together again when you get the chance. You see, she's also hinting that there's a next time and it will be better. It'll be so delicious. You can't help saying yum. So I'm wondering if all of these are chains of activities. Which would be cool. I'm 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 uh, here for it. I also didn't check what Akihiko's item gave us last time. So we'll check what hers gives us. And his at the same time. Come to think of it. By the way, do you know Mitsuru Kurijo, the student council president? I heard she's gonna study abroad after high school. Probably to prepare herself to run the Kurijo group in the future. Wow. Wow, that's crazy. It's like she lives in a different world from us plebs. But she's staying in a dorm, right? Why would a rich girl want to live in a dump like that? Hmm. Maybe her family made her to understand how us ordinary folks live or something. Okay. I mean, the dorm isn't bad. Seems fine. Hello. Do you have a moment? Sure. I was just told that the chairman will be stopping by this evening. When you get back, make sure to come to the fourth floor. Oh, okay then. I wonder why. I'll see you all later. Hmm. Okay. Talk about short notice. Maybe he wants to tell us a new joke. Who knows? But I am a little curious. Guess I'll head straight back today. Oh, wait a second. I might know what this is. I was just kind of going... Koro-chan, shake! This is not what I thought it was, but yes, I do remember this. <laughs> oh, he did it! What a smart dog! Oh, welcome back! Hey there! Hmm, can I pet him? Sure, go on, Koro-chan. You know how to say hi, right? <laughs> His name's Koromaru. I've seen him sitting by the steps of the shrine. Oh, this dog still goes on walks all by himself? What do you mean? He used to belong to the priest at the Naganaki Shrine. Every afternoon, the two of them went this way for a walk. So that's what he was doing here. That is, until the priest passed away. He passed away? Oh, you haven't heard the story? I think it was about six months ago. The priest was hit by a car while walking his dog. He didn't survive. Ever since then, that dog has continued to go on walks, always stopping to sit by the site of the accident. But he refuses to let anyone take him in. Why, just the other day, my son... Oh my goodness, look at the time. I must be going. My son will be home soon. Oh, goodbye. Such a loyal dog. Good boy. Huh? Is he? What's wrong? Uh, oh, nothing. Sorry. More importantly, isn't the chairman coming today? We should probably go get ready. Yeah, you're right. See you later, Koro-chan. Arf to you too, dog. Arf to you too. Hello, everyone. Hello. I gathered you all here because I wanted to let you know how my research has been going. It concerns the shadows that have been appearing during full moons. Now, I want you to listen closely. It might be hard to follow. Shadows can be divided into 12 categories according to their characteristics. This we've known for a while. We can think of it like their class or order. I've classified the special shadows we've seen so far, and, well, it's simply fascinating. 
Why are you so excited about it? So... Ah, right. Those four shadows belong to categories one through four in order of their appearance. They may have looked different than the more common ones, but the classification scheme still applies. And that's something we should be excited about? Oh, I get it. There are 12 in all, and eight we haven't seen yet. That's exactly right, Yamagishi-kun. You're quite sharp. Oh, uh, okay, but what are they after? That's a good question, and that's what we haven't figured out yet. Their motive. They don't kill their prey. They feed on their minds. Now, it could be considered predation, but is it really? Is there actually an underlying intent behind their behavior? The purpose of the shadows as a whole. That's what we need to consider. Okay. This is interesting. But no matter what their intent, we still have to beat the rest of them. I agree. That's about all we can do at this point. Eight more, huh? Lucky us. According to the data, each one has been stronger than the last. That means we better start training harder. We'll manage. We've got plenty of time. But why does Tartarus even exist in the first place? Great question. <sighs> hmm. The puzzle pieces are falling into place one by one. We're only two months into the game. The puzzle pieces haven't even been shown yet. Those large shadows that only appear on the full moon. I wonder what their purpose is. Eight more remain. We have a long road ahead of us. Yes, as they say, eight more remain. There's a lot more game to go. Okay. The wait is over. The weekend Wild Duck set is finally here. Okay. You're not getting anywhere near my potatoes. Wait, we're cooking to we're growing tomatoes. You're not getting anywhere near my tomatoes. Oh. What up? Take care of the planters up top, right? Mind if I give it a try? Girls are into slim dudes, right? Might be good to eat some vegetables after all. No. Oh. Okay. Hello. Hmm. Everything about Tartarus is such a mystery. How long has it been there? Why did it appear in the first place? Do you think we'll ever know the answers? Hello. Oh, upon closer inspection, there is a book called 100 Best Pun Puns mixed in with the complex books. Wonder who's reading it. I meant to speak to you. Um, um. I ran an estimate on the strength of the remaining large shadows that appear during full moons. And as you can probably guess, we're going to be in for a long, hard fight. But I think we can handle it. I'm sure we'll be fine as long as you keep training and growing stronger in Tartarus. All right. So let's both do our best. Hmm. I'm sorry. I'm thinking right now. If you're looking for someone to talk to, please find someone else. All right, little root. Hello. Mm. The real question is: Do shadows act independently, or are they working together towards some some goal? In essence, does a group of shadows target a single human and ravage his mind with purpose, or does each individual shadow simply devouring human minds for, or is each individual shadow simply devouring human minds for their own survival? This is what we must discern. Okay. Uh, TV. Our topic today is the rising divorce rate among June brides. Lately, divorce is becoming more common, sometimes happening immediately after the honeymoon. What causes this? We'll report right after these messages. Okay. Um, I wanted to have a look at the items that we've got. So we got a chicken saute, which is 100 HP. So that's exactly what we got from that. Well, no, it's not actually. That's... Okay, that's 100 HP to everyone. Not exactly the same as what we got. And then what did uh, we get from... Oh, we got something down here maybe from... I'm trying to figure out... Oh yeah, the Iron Athlete meal. Increases all allies attack for three turns. I mean, that's pretty good. That's what we got from um, Akihiko. Alright, what do you want to watch on TV? Hey. 
do you know how to use the DVD player here? Thought I might as well use it once in a while. I have this compilation of some of the greatest matches between boxing legends. Watching professional te techniques like this will surely help us in our own battles. So I might gain courage. Okay, and then I can hang out with Fuka. Wanna watch it together if you have time now? Let's do it. Yes. Alright, let's start watching. Just from looking at a single jab, you can tell how different everything is at the top level. And not only are both fighters strong, they each have their own unique fighting style. What kind of fighter is your favorite? Um... I don't know. Um, slick footwork. Dodging and diving. Let's go with that. I get that. The essence of boxing is to land hits without getting hit yourself. I tend to rely on footwork in my matches too. But someday, I'm hoping to master the style of infighting. Now that I'm watching these again, I can see there's a lot to learn from professional matches. Plus, when I do it here, I have someone to discuss things with. Let's do this again next time you're free. Okay. Well, that was much shorter, and definitely did not feel like that was leading into something else. So I'm wondering whether the DVDs are just kind of like one-time things, while maybe the books have more, or maybe the cooking has more? I have no idea. It's all theorizing, as before. Courage? Nope. Okay. Man, watching those guys fighting is making it hard for me to sit still. You want to head to my room and wail in the punching bag for a bit? Uh, is that a euphemism? Well, we nodded. Right. It's Sunday. Tanaka! No, no, no. I'm not interested. Tanaka's here. I got a text message. Sorry to bother you. Hello, it's Fushimi. Would you like to go somewhere together? Sorry for the short notice. If you have some time and are interested, please let me know before the end of the afternoon. Thank you. We do want to hang out with her. Um, but yes, um, we also want to speak to Tanaka. We want to see Tanaka's thing, which means we have to say no immediately and then we can come back to it. Also, we want to see who's available during the day. Oh, I wonder whether some of these cooking things are available during the day. That would be interesting. It's amazing commodities! I'm your host Tanaka, and what have you got? It. The diet support set. Hate exercising? Don't want to change your diet? Looking for an easy way to lose weight? <laughs> then do we have good news for you. Good, good. First up, we have the amenity suit. Slip into this and, your and the hourglass body you dream of will be all yours. Oh my goodness, it's wonderful. But wait, there's more. Bad, we'll throw kid. in this super diet food too. Guess how many? Three. All this for 9,800 yen. Oh, my money. Okay, well, goodbye. There goes all of our money. Thanks, well, I still have some. Kid. Home gardening set. Ooh, but okay. Well, we'll, we'll um, definitely keep an eye out for that. Let's head downstairs and see what we got going on. Oh, also, who's available? Maya, health food, movies, and there's Chihiro. Okay, hello. Good morning. Wow, there's no one here. Everyone must have gone out. I think Yukari-chan went to the shrine again. I don't have any plans for today, so I think I'll just stay here. If you want to head out, then you should, Zaplakun. Don't worry about me, I'm fine. Okay, uh, I'm going to go to the shrine then. Just because it was suggested that she went to the shrine. Oh, hello. Oh, Oh, hello, Zaplasan. Hey. I've been chatting with Madakun today, and boy, he is really mature, you know? He definitely acts a lot more adult than Junpei. Uh, no, no. Jeez, Yucatan, what's that mean? How about you? You think I'm totally the more... You think I'm totally the more mature one, right? Amada's uh, more mature. Wait, you two? Come on, man, that's messed up. Gang on me like that. <laughs> uh, nobody over here. Okay. Let's leave, and... Just want to see who's available. Gourmet King. Yeah, I'm going to head to here, not because I want to do this one, but because I want to do a run-through during the day. Hello. Man, I'm so lazy these days. I think I've got that apathy syndrome thing. Maybe. 
Dude, I was just kidding. Don't take it so seriously, man. Okay. Uh, Skilled Reporter, by the way, uh, was available at night, but is also available during the day. Wonder if that's true for all of them. I don't know. Maybe the ta- yeah, the same with the taxi driver, then there's no reason to check here at night. I asked my friend if his cat was really expensive. You know what he said? He said it was free. He said his mom got the cat from the animal shelter. I didn't know you could do that. I thought you could only get cats from pet stores. Yeah, but like, I mean, even if you get it from the animal shelter, it's not free, boy. You got like, pay for food and things. It's not, it's not like it's a zero cost thing. Yeah, so he was also someone we spoke to at night. So there is no real reason to check at night over day. My teacher uses special stationery, but it's so childish. We're sixth graders, and he treats us like little kids. Childish? Like, Mr. Bear and Mr. Frog are on it, and they're rapping. It's weird. He's so quiet. I didn't imagine he was thinking of that. Okay. Um, I'll leave you be. Oh, uh. Yeah, we'll hang out with you. Yes. Actually, not now. No, yeah, we'll hang out. Sorry, I was thinking there was something else we needed to do, but we don't. Let's reply to her. What a relief. Phew, I'm glad that that illustration book is still there. But... Um, sorry for changing the topic, but I'm still worried about the missing money. Hmm. I hope it was just some kind of mistake. It's sad to think that there might be a thief at our school. Um... Wasn't a thief. How much money was it? Or maybe they regret it now. Hmm, what were we gonna say? What does she want us to say? Don't worry, it wasn't a thief. How much was it? Or maybe they regret it. I'm gonna say maybe they regret it. I'm not gonna ask how much was it. I think that's wrong. I think maybe they regret it might be good. I don't want to assume that it actually was a thief, but maybe you're right. Haha, it was the right answer. I was worried for a second. Perhaps it was just the heat of the moment. I, I don't want to think that they're just evil. Chihiro is nodding. I learned a little more about her today. I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean for you to have to listen to my worries on your day off. Um, how about I treat you to something as a thank you? We spent some more time at the strip mall together before I returned to the dorm. I don't know if that means we got enough points or not. We got three points though, which seems good. Oh. <laughs> Weird transition. On the next episode of Phoenix Ranger Featherman R. Episode 18, Death of a Condor. Get your hankies ready, kids. On to today's news. The wait is over. The wild duck set is here. Okay. Uh, hello, everybody. Looks like Kirijo Senpai and Sonata Senpai aren't around, so let's go to Tartarus some other time. I think I'll take it easy tonight, too. Hey! Koromaru is so cute, and he's such a loyal dog. Why, certainly. I wish we could take Koro-chan in and look after him here. Sonata Senpai could be in charge of walking him, since he goes jogging quite often anyway. <laughs> right? Yeah, I could totally see them running along the river together or something. But I doubt that we'd be allowed to keep animals in the dorm. Karamaru is really one of a kind, huh? Uh huh? He really is, and such an obedient boy, too. He always seems to be at the shrine. I wonder if he's eating okay. Oh, really? Why don't we just keep him here? I feel like Kirijo senpai would say yes. I mean, doesn't she seem like the type to have a Doberman at home? Feel and she'd feed it the highest quality filet mignon. Well... Junpei-kun, I think you read too much manga. I mean, two things can be true at once. Um, okay, so none of them want to hang out, so we have no hangout events? That is true. Hmm. So, I just want to point out, they gave us a new thing. It only happens during the evening, but on the day of the week where it's worst to not be, or it is worst to leave, uh, you know, the dorm, is the one day of the week nobody is available. I'm just saying, it's a little, uh, weird as a decision. Because why is it the worst day, you might be asking? Well, let me tell you. Let me head all the way over here to show you. It is the worst day because the arcade is garbage on a Sunday. Let me show you. Because none of these are social stats, therefore, they are effectively useless. Jack Frostall, 
Yes, uh, play until I win a prize. Uh, play. Let's see how much this costs. Okay. Okay, that only cost us 1.2. That's not bad. Okay. Well, did you like that? You want to see it again? Because that's what we're doing. Play. And we'll speed this one up. Wow, even sped up. Not that quick. That only cost us 200. That's not bad. I guess it just does a dice roll or whatever. You know, it does a roll in the background and says like, Okay, it took this much. That's fine. Play until you win a prize. Like, it just does the RNG until it, it works. I do wonder if you can get really screwed though and like it takes all your money. Or whether it has like a cap. I don't know. Anyway. Hello. Good day. Uh, about requests? Are you accepting a request? Wonderful. Yes. That physical manifestation of Jack Frost. Yes, no doubt. It is a Jack Frost doll. I'm greatly fond of Jack Frost. May I touch it? Marvelous. Oh my, so soft. To be honest, I was conflicted over what sort of Jack Frost request to make. I also considered asking you to nurture him until he reached level 99, but... I'm glad I chose to make this request in the end since I've got such a cute doll out of it. I'm looking forward to that it. That said, I would love to see Jack Frost at his strongest one day. Please take this as your reward. Three Twilight Fragments. Okay. So now the only missions we have with her are like continue doing stuff in Tartarus. That's fine. No, I'm good. Very well. See ya. Uh, am good I good? Day. I humbly request you escort me somewhere once again. Ah, okay, so it was locked behind the Jack Frost. This time I would like to investigate a certain area known as Iwatodai. I shall be waiting if now. you have the time, then please fetch me so that uh, so long as the sun is out. Okay, well, Very the well. sun isn't out right now, so I'm gonna, like, leave. Um, but yeah, this is the worst day to be out and about. But we can go to the strip mall, and we can get a wild duck burger... Yeah, increase our courage a little bit. Yes, weekend wild duck set. Let's go. Okay, ordered from a secret menu at a Watadai strip mall at night. Achievement unlocked. It a strange, perplexing taste, but I finished it anyway. You get two points of courage. We are now fearless. Oh, badass is level six courage. So you need level 6 courage to speak to Fuka. That definitely explains why nobody did it. It's not this that nobody pushed to level 5. It's that you have to have, like, basically just only done courage until this point. Okay. Well. That explains it. Okay. Also, I love that you need, like, the top level courage to even eat hey, her cooking. So... Hey, Zaplacoon, I've been thinking... The night before last, when we learned about the Twelve Shadows and their connection to Tartarus, isn't there just too much we don't understand? You think so? Yeah. Hmm, it just seems... Uh, it's just something about it that bugs me. Okay. That's fine. Uh, afternoon? Oh, hey! It it's not the nurse! Beautiful? Oh gosh, Kardashian! coordinates really are beautiful, aren't they? This one in particular is my favorite, though. Are you curious? You are, right? Right? What am I looking at? This curve is a graph of a Cartes Cartesian equation, one that was discovered by Italian mathematician Maria Agnesi. It's actually named after her. Some people call it the curve of Agnesi. So, that... However, it's more commonly known by another name, Iori. Do you have any idea what that is? Huh? How would I know? Heck, are we even talking about math anymore? Uh, Alpax, do you know the answer? I mean, what's it look like? It looks a little bit like a wheelbarrow? Um, okay. So what do they call it? Well, he said in this, where are we? Uh, he said they call it the curve of Agnesi. So, they probably wouldn't call it the Witch of Agnesi as well, right? One of those would just 
and B used more than the other, which means that we're between these two. Fermat spiral seems wrong because it's not a spiral. So I think it's orthogonal curves because that's probably like a, a straightforward description of what it is. Mm, that's not right. That's not correct. Was my question too difficult? Is it Witch of Agnesi? The curve of Agnesi is more famously known as the Witch of Agnesi. As to why it's called a witch, nobody really knows. Apparently it came from a mistranslation of the Italian word for the first sign of a curve. Of course, how could I not have known that? Merely an inadvertent mistake, I suppose. Uh, I make careless mistakes fairly often as well, but it's pretty embarrassing when your last mistake lasts for generations, or when your mistake lasts for generations. I mean, the shape of the curve resembled a witch, maybe they could have gotten away with it, but alas. Yo, how are we supposed to figure out that without any hints? Okay, I gave him the wrong answer. Well, I don't know. I didn't figure it out, so I don't know how we were meant to figure it out without any hints. I guess because it says Agnesi in it, but it seemed like a red herring. Everybody, uh, you know, lighting up her phone. That's fine. Hello. All right. Eight left, huh? Well, you can count on me, dudes. I'll defeat every one of them and save the city. Okay. Hello. Yeah. Zaplacoon. I'm. It's still not clear to me. My head hurts from thinking about it. Hmm. Okay. Well, I think we're gonna end. Get away from him. I think we're gonna end the episode there. Thank you very much for watching. And next time, we're gonna go hang out with Elizabeth. I'll see you then. Goodbye.